Uh, this is a video that's done before you even get started. <clears throat> I'm on a, uh, obviously a volleyball court. And you look around and see all the holes I've dug. So I'm going to count the holes and then go home and count the coins in my pocket and look at them. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That was 15 and 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. There's 21 and 22, 23, 24, 25. I can't remember if I counted that, so we'll count that as 26. This is 27, and I found two coins on the ground. So now I'm headed back to my wagon, and we'll go home and see if any of them are old. After about a 20 minute hunt, uh, I'm back at the house, found uh, 37 coins out of about 20 something holes, so three quarters. The oldest that I found were, uh, I forget this one, it's 50 something I believe. It ain't showing up. So you won't get to enjoy it like I do. All right, 56. 56, then I got a 41 nickel. That's the oldest, oldest out here. And then the rest of the nickels are modern, and then all the, well, they're all modern, and a bunch of dimes, and uh, a couple of pennies, a cat who remains here all the time. All right, thanks for watching this short hunt. Back at the two old houses where I found uh, some of the older things and the two uh, lead ingots that I was hoping was silver, and I just got a decent signal, and I dug this, some type of, pendant or badge or something but I can't get it cleaned up real good yet but I have to do it when I get to the house you can see where it clasped onto something anyway I'm gonna keep looking around in here another spot here looks like some sort of a grommet so I'm having second thoughts about the first one I just dug but anyway tons of high signals out here in all this household trash that's been buried and torn up but I'm going to keep digging around. Pretty high signal, but I dug it and it's a wing off of something. I don't know what it's made out of, but uh, it actually wasn't a real high signal. It was mid, but anyway, see if I can find the rest of it. Signal. It's brass. Bullet. Guess somebody's reloading their own around here. Alright. Move on to another spot. I was getting a high tone, but then I looked at this, couldn't figure out what it was. Sorry. And I figured it out. It's a lock on a door. There's a, there's the uh, latch. So I must have some brass in it. Anyway, pretty neat. Yeah, the signals I'm getting here. So it finally jumps up in the 60s and 70s every now and then. So then I start digging. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. Well, as it was jumpy, it's iron, but it's plated in something, so that's why it's giving a high squeak every now and then. I think it's the striker plate for that old uh, skeleton key lock I found. So, I'll take it with me.